From News 5, here's your Power of 5 weather and today's top stories. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. I'm Power 5 meteorologist Ramisha Shade. We're wrapping things up for the weekend, but of course it's always nice to be able to get a new work week started and school week. For tonight though, we'll keep things pretty quiet with your weather. No need for the rain gear, no need for the snow brush. We should stay dry. Temperatures will be chilly though for this time of the year. It's almost May and we're still talking about 30. So grab the jacket, maybe the coat, because we'll dip to the upper 30s with a few clouds building in overnight. Tracy? Okay, Ramisha, thank you. Hello, everybody. I'm Tracy Carlos, and here's a look at today's top stories. Cleveland police are investigating an officer involved shooting on the city's east side. Officers got a call around 9.30 this morning that a man carjacked a woman at gunpoint. Then a half hour later, they got reports of that same man showing a weapon in a local laundromat. When police tracked him down, they say he tried to run, and officers exchanged fire with the man. He's in the hospital in serious condition right now. A major project starts tomorrow in Cuyahoga Falls to replace aging concrete on the busy Howell Avenue. Starting tomorrow, the part of Howell Avenue between State Route 8 and Home will close for 35 days. You will have to detour on Talmadge Avenue to get around it. After that, the eastbound lanes will be closed for several more months. The work is expected to be done in time for the Christmas shopping season. As many as 22,000 drivers use this one-mile stretch each and every day. And Twinsburg police arrested a man Saturday afternoon after officers found him with a missing 14 year old girl from Akron. Police say Akron police called them and said the two may be in the area. Officers say they then found the teen with 35 year old Michael Johnson. He's behind bars right now, charged with interference with custody and unlawful sexual conduct with a minor. Both are felonies and Twinsburg police say more charges could be coming. For the very latest news and weather, go to News5Cleveland.com or open our News 5 app. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.